Redbeard is going to get all up in a naughty neighbor today. Ooh. What be going down, people of the world? Redbeard here, coming at you from his couch. Welcome to Daily Drink Vlog fucking whatever type thing number 65. 65 is the atomic number of terbium and the traditional retirement age for people in Canada, US, Germany, UK, and many other countries. Huh. As always, all the thanks in the whole wide world going out to those of you watching my videos. The Beard loves you all so much. Fucking right he does. Anyway, for the beer of the today, we got a can of Naughty Neighbor American Pale Ale by the Nickel Brook Brewing Company. I had a couple beers by these guys. They're the ones who made the Bolshevik Bastard. Yeah. And Pale Ale? I don't know. I think those are generally the pine needle-y ones. Let's get in this, bitch! Today's glass? Let's see what we got. Oh, it's definitely, definitely pale. That's, it looks nice, but it doesn't, it doesn't mean a thing. Kind of cloudy. Definitely got some cloudiness going on. Lots of cloudiness, actually. Oh, my. Yep. Pretty sure this is the pine needly one. God damn it. Let's give her a shot. Oh, ho, 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 ho. wow. Yeah, very piney. Oh, it's like somebody was able to super concentrate the flavor of a Christmas tree or something. And they mixed it like two-thirds beer and one-third of that flavor. Let's do this! <laughs> Holy crap! That's... not tasty! Oh! oh. <laughs> Yeah, so pale ales and India pale ales. Those, those are enemies of the me. <sighs> Mortal enemies. <sighs> Sometimes neighbors are just too enticing to resist. Our award-winning APA pays homage to our naughty neighbors to the south, as our American Pale Ale has something for everyone. For hop lovers, the huge citrus and pine aromas greet the nose and continue on to the palate, leaving a remarkably easy drinking, crisp, dry finish. No. We pack all this flavor into a brew that is 4.9% alcohol, which gives a hugely sessionable beer that is perfectly refreshing. I'm going to go ahead and disagree with everything except the pine part. Oh, not refreshing. No, no, ah. Doesn't say the actual uh, ingredients, just it contains malted wheat and barley, and then it has brewer's elements. Malt, two-row pale ale, car, car, carap dam, caradam. I don't know, the can's got a weird fucking finish on it that's blowing shit out. Karastan and flaked wheat? Hops, Cascade, Centennial, and Citra? Yeast, California. Sure, why not? All I'm getting is pure liquid evil. Pretty much. So much pine, not getting a single little speck of citrus anything. 
All pine. I think I might actually dislike APAs more than IPAs. Like, this is worse than that dinner jacket red IPA shit that Marcel gave me. Again, it's just my opinion. Your taste buds might jump for joy at something like this. And if they do, you and I probably wouldn't want to share a meal or something. Because we like different things. Oh, this is so remarkably not tasty on so many different levels. Fuck it. I don't want to do any more. Drink number the last. God damn! Hey! Tiniest little hint of citrus right there. Oh, there comes the pine. That's actually one of those beers that's a little bit better if you chug it somehow. Oh, just a bit though. So, uh, Nickel Brick Brewery, guys. I, I gotta find something by you that I like because it's it's not going well. Your American Pale Ale, Naughty Neighbor stuff, not so much recommended by the beard. Not so much. And that is gonna do it for today's daily drink vlog fucking whatever type thing. Thank you so much for watching this video. If you watched it, didn't watch it, obviously I'm talking to you. If you liked it, then be sure to smash that like button with your face. Hoop -yaw, hoop -yaw, hoop -yaw! Ah! Thanks again, and I'll be back very, 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 very soon. Peace out! Definitely a very cool bottle though. Even just the shape of it and everything, and they got these kind of... Oh, it's a witch. They got witches engraved in the... Look at that shit. That's awesome. Little witches engraved in the glass. That is so not engraved, but like they're like raised. You know what I'm saying? These are. Well, that's getting rinsed out.